November 2013, Typhoon Haiyan made landfall in the eastern Samar region of the Philippines, bringing with it strong winds and heavy rainfall which devastated entire cities and towns in its path. The widespread destruction by the typhoon caused logistical problems and difficulties in obtaining data about the extent of the damages. This severely delayed the humanitarian response, which ultimately prolonged the suffering of affected communities as they waited for critical supplies to arrive. From this illustration, time is of the essence, and it is imperative that humanitarian organizations are able to quickly identify the extent of damages resulting from a disaster and develop a plan accordingly. This takes us to our solution. Our proposed solution is aimed at assisting humanitarian actors in planning the disaster response by helping them to make decisions about the type and amount of supplies required, as well as providing a platform for different stakeholders to collaborate and share best practices. This application is targeted at humanitarian organizations, local authorities, and even private actors who are engaged in responding to a crisis. Every feature and mechanism of this proposed solution is made with efficiency in mind, so that humanitarian actors and their responses can be carried out quickly and effectively to save the lives of those affected by natural so now I would like to show you our prototype that we have made so far. So this app is designed and has the ultimate aim of answering the challenge. How might we gather data more efficiently and accurately in order to estimate the extent of damages from a natural disaster so that humanitarian actors can plan a response more efficiently? There are two key features of this app. The first is a logistics calculator, and the second is an online platform for stakeholders in the humanitarian sector to collaborate and plan their responses to minimize waste and to ensure efficiency. Now turning towards the first feature, which is a logistics calculator. So what this logistics calculator basically does is it takes key indicators from the sphere standards, such as the amount of liters each household needs, and it calculates how many, uh, the type and amount of supplies needed based on population data. So if we see here, uh, in the event that there is a natural disaster and it affects, and there are 600 uh, adults to 400 children in need of assistance, the algorithm will then uh, apply that towards the fear standards, fear standards and then calculate that 50,000 liters uh, of water need to be transported to the beneficiaries. This is not all. This number is then translated into tangible products for those humanitarian organizations to plan. So here, 50,000 liters amounts to 11,000 gallons, which can then be translated again to approximately 46 tons of transport weight in order to uh, ensure efficiency and sustainability. Now, uh, this app can also help in disaster preparedness, where humanitarian organizations before a disaster occurs, they can input their availability of their supplies in their warehouses to help in you know, inventory keeping and preparing for the next disaster. Now, this leads directly into the next key feature of this application, and that is the online platform for collaboration. What this online platform basically is, is it is an encrypted messaging service similar to WhatsApp and Telegram, where humanitarian actors can group them, can make themselves into groups and communicate in order to share uh, information and best practices when responding to a natural disaster. What differentiates uh, this application and our solution from those other messaging services is the integration of the logistics calculator. So as you can see from this, uh, where the calculator calculates that we need 11,000 gallons, we can share this into the messages and ping uh, the other actors, say you are in collaboration with the uh, Red Cross, we can ping and communicate to the Red Cross that, hey, we need around uh, however many thousand gallons of water for our 
humanitarian operation. From this, you can also share pictures and share lo your location and have and push an emergency uh, button. This is the SOS button to uh, if anything urgent arises. Now, uh, those are the key features of our uh, of our application as of now. This application we envision will have unlimited scalability and unlimited innovation uh, for the future. For these indicators of innovation, we propose three ideas. The first is to add even more indicators towards our logistics calculator, such as, you know, not just estimating affected population, but also estimating extent of property damage to help uh, assist in determining the amount of supply kits and shelter repair kits needed, and also, uh, and also add uh, capability for route planning and route uh, route planning and route uh, tracking of supplies, and also uh, we would like to add offline capability. As we know, uh, as we know, disasters would disrupt communications, and so we would really like to add offline capability for this uh, to use this application. So uh, that would be the end of my presentation. Uh, thank you very much.